Here at Outside, there's a real buzz and excitement with all the new running products we're getting in. Most notably, this brand, Icebug. Icebug is the first carbon positive outdoor footwear brand. So they use recycled materials, environmentally friendly processes from the factory to the way it's made. They also double offset, making them carbon positive. The soles and rubber on all the shoes is really, really sticky and works really well in the Peak District. It's 15% recycled. Now that might not sound like a lot, but they've tried higher levels of recycling, but actually that gets compromised on the stickiness and the durability. So making something twice and having to chuck it in the bin is actually worse than just using slightly recycled. This is really evident in the flex you'll see on the bottom of the shoe. It also looks pretty cool as well. All the uppers are 100% recycled materials, so this is plastic bottles or offcuts from the factory. Even the colouring of the shoes has been thought about. They use natural dyes and they do this at a yarn level instead of a fabric level because this uses much less water in the process. The midsole in all the shoes is using 20% balloon foam. Now this is actually used from algae and also the insole is used from the offcut of the balloon foam. All the plastic rands and reinforcements on the shoes and the eyelets and things like that are actually made from recycled fishnets that they pull out of the sea. That's another good thing. So this shoe is the Acceleratus. This is really gonna come onto its own in winter because the bigger lugs on it and the really sticky sole make it really perfect for fell races, particularly in the Peak District with sort of grit stone, then muddy trails. It really performs brilliantly. It has a four mil drop and is fairly flexible. So it really feels like you're fast and nimble in these. They're quite popular for swim run races. So what that really means is they don't hold much moisture. That's really important in the UK, especially in the Peak District and Lake District, where you get really wet all the time. There's puddles and rivers. So you want them to stay light and not absorb any water. This is the Horizon. This has been described as the Cruiser. This is because it's got a seven mil drop. So it's got a bit more cushioning in the heel. Also slightly more relaxed at the front. So you could actually wear this from sort of city to trail. It still worked really well if you're running along standard jets, but mainly better on the sort of trails than it is on the fells. It still features really grippy rubber on the sole, but the lugs are a little bit smaller so that it will sort of give you better durability if you do use it on the road quite a lot. We actually debated which area of the shop would put this in because I think people use this for running, but they're also going to use it as their everyday trainer as well. You could just use it for gym work, going to work, or even going to the pub. This shoe is the Capra. It sits nicely between the other two shoes we talked about. It still has a seven mil drop. It has the slightly more relaxed forefoot, but a slightly tighter heel just to keep your heel down while really pounding out the miles. The rubber on the sole is just as sticky as ever, but the lugs are slightly bigger on this one, just for a little bit more off-road. There's a rock plate in the forefoot of the shoe, which gives you a little bit of protection if you're rock hopping and sort of gives it a bit of stability. And in the back half of the foot, it's got a torsion plate, which really helps spring and keep you going and give you a little bit more stability. The Capra was specifically designed with the Glencoe Skyline race in mind hence the pattern on the side of the shoe. So this is the one I think is a real Peak District runners all rounder. You can use it on the trail and the fells and maybe even a little bit of road as well. We have all three of these in the women's fit as well, so please come in and try them. And if you can't decide between all our running shoes, why not go for the most environmentally friendly running shoe on the market? Well, the proof is in the pudding, so let's go and test them. <laughs> That's how I run, just like that. <laughs> I'm off! Boris is after me!